It's impossible to see the incredible connection between little Bryson McKen and Sophie Hansen. Today we're at the zoo together. Together again after life-saving surgeries and rough starts to their young lives. When Bryson was born, his bilirubin was elevated. A week old, we were just like, wow, he's orange, like just doesn't look right. It's a confirmed diagnosis of biliary atresia. A childhood disease of the liver that impacts bile ducts, leading to complete liver malfunction. A similar battle Sophie and her family knew all too well. When I was three, I was diagnosed with an autoimmune liver disease called primary sclerosing cholangitis. Sophie's long-term progressive disease of the liver and gallbladder caused inflammation and scarring to the bile ducts beyond repair, with only one option left for the preteen. When I was 11 years old, they listed me on the transplant list. For Bryson, the same outlook and only hope for a second chance at life. He was put on a liver transplant list at four months old. Two different children waiting with one special answer. It truly does bless lives. A single life-saving donor for both Bryson and Sophie. They split the liver from the deceased donor and gave part to me and part to another little boy. The liver is the only visceral organ that can regenerate. So one organ was able to save two lives and that was really amazing. Making these transplant surgeries possible, both with a successful outcome. You would never know anything ever was medically wrong with Bryson. I feel so much more hope for the future. And double the living proof of the gift of hope. Sign up to be an organ donor. It's one of the easiest things you can do to save a lot of people's lives.